Good morning, Miss Curtis. Rain, snow, and sleet. Do you realize that in California the sun is shining, flowers are in bloom? <laughs> well, it won't be long now. Oh, are you going to California, Mr. Tweedy? Yes, indeed. Hollywood. Uh, that is, just as soon as I sell my first scenario. Then there'll be no more moiling and slaving and toiling for that tyrant Joseph Hornslocker. Good morning, Mr. Hornslocker. Here. Good morning, Mr. Hornslocker. One minute to nine. Everybody here but Kennedy. I made it. Yes, you made it all right. But it'll take you an hour to catch your breath and be in a condition to work. Hereafter, try getting an earlier start and stop running races with the clock. Always picking on me. If I get a race so I can get a car, I won't always be sticking in under the wire. By golly, I'm going right in now and have a showdown. Let me see, I better, I think I better figure out how much I think I'm worth. Have you that report you were supposed to check over last night? Oh, oh the report? Oh, I guess I left it at home, Mr. Hornslocker. Oh, that's all right. Uh, come into my office. I'll dictate a new one. Yes, sir. During your lunch hour. Lunch hour? Policy 89764. 89764. Tom Hawkins. Tom Hawkins. Policy 20862. J.C. Robinson. $72. $72. 62341. Titus. 4250. Pie. Pie. I've been eating pie. I never eat pie. It doesn't agree with me. My wife made that pie, Mr. Hornslocker. It wouldn't hurt a baby. Baby? It wouldn't. Wouldn't it? No, I sure it wouldn't. Your wife's an excellent cook, Kennedy. I'll have to invite myself over to your house to dinner someday. You know, it's the first of the month, Mr. Hornslocker, and, and I was just thinking. I know it's the first of the month. I just had a reminder. Come here. Look. See that? Well, thank you. Thank you. See you next month. Uh, but Mr. Hornslocker, he looked like a good risk when I wrote the policy. He said he was an artist. A aerial artist. A necrobat. Oh. 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 Gee, that's swell, Dad. You'd be another Buck Jones if you wasn't so fat. Hello? Oh, hello, Mr. Hornslager. I hate to ask you to work on Sunday, but there are a few items here that must be checked. Oh, but Chief Boss, sir. Uh, Chief Boss, sir. Uh, I'll have Tweety bring it right over to your house. Uh, uh, Hello? Hello? What's the matter, dear? Oh, look at this. What do you think of that slave driver sending Tweety down here with a lot of work for me to do? Oh, that's too bad. No, I'd better straighten this place up. Store. It's beginning to look like two a pig pen. I get nothing. I'm using so paper ground more than any one man I've ever seen. No wonder they have revolutions in this country. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> nice 
I see you're happy to dinner, Al. You know, I don't get around much these days. It's all right, Jim. It's a pleasure to have you. Now. Well, Tom, that's your friend Logan, isn't it? He ain't no friend of mine. Wonder what he's doing around here. Oh, just visiting the people next door, I guess. The very sight of that guy spoils my whole day. Oh, so it's you, eh? <laughs> yes, I brought you your homework. Hello, Austin. Hello, Ann. Just a few items. But don't tell me you have a movie camera. I'll say. It's a genuine suburban, Mr. Tweedy. I have a marvelous idea. Let's make a picture from one of my scenarios. Here is my latest drama. I just finished it this morning. You can be the leading lady. <laughs> I'm the hero. And Kennedy is a rat. Who's a rat? Just in the play, of course, just in the play. The character is a low-down scoundrel. We'll call him Joseph Hornslocker and get even with the boss without him knowing it. Say, that's an inducement. Let's see that. When does it start? Oh, hurry up and Now, Bud, you put the camera right down there. Oh, so glad I could. My, my, my. You both look perfect. Now, we'll start off by shooting the scene where Tom, as the unscrupulous lumber baron, deserts his Indian wife and their baby. It's right there. But that's the last scene in the picture. Of course. That's the way they do it in Hollywood. Oh. Well, uh, all right, uh, uh, let's shoot it. Wait a minute. Camera. Do not leave me, Joseph. That guy makes me sick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop! You cheated me, you cur. <laughs> Curses. Wait! We'll settle this like men. Huh. Uh. Gee, the neighbors next door must be fighting again. Yes, it looks as though they mean business this Let, time. Let's see what it's all about. <laughs> hey, what's the big idea? What's going on over there? Oh, we're just making movies, Mr. Thompson. Making movies? Well, somebody's going to pay for my window. Oh, we'll making pay Making movies. For it. You'll bet you'll pay for it. Movies or no movies. It's a long time since you've been on one of those, eh, Jim? You said it. All right, now. Come on. Now, this is the part after I've killed you. Oh, yes. So you lay down on the ground. Yes. All right, bud. Camera. Okay. Cyril. Be quiet. Hey. Hey, what's the idea? Oh, this is a clinch. I'm just putting a little <clears throat> into it. I'll put a little oomph in you. Honey. Well, good evening, Mr. Hornslocker. Now, you sit right there. Uh, good evening, Mrs. Kennedy. I haven't seen you for quite a while. Well, I don't get around very much. Well, I, I didn't know I was coming to a banquet. Oh, oh. Won't you sit down, please? Thanks. Oh, 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 I'm so sorry. Are you hurt, Mr. Hornslocker? That's all right, Kennedy. Accidents will happen. Look, Bud, I got her film. Already? Yeah, they finished it a day ahead of time. Oh, gee, that's well. Hooray, folks, here's our super colossal oh. epic. Oh, Mr. Hornslock, I, I didn't know you were here. Hello, Tweety. What's all the excitement? Uh, uh, why, uh, you see, Mr. Hornslock, uh, uh, we got a little surprise for you tonight. We're going to have some movies. Well, really? Oh, gee, that's well. Let's go set up a machine, Mr. Tweety. All right, Bud, oh, on oh, with the show. You know, I don't see how they finish those films so quick. <gasps> Why, we only made them on Sunday. Huh? Why, Tom, what's the matter with you? Sunday? Oh, that's the day you were ill and couldn't make out my report. Uh, oh, Mr. Hornslacker, won't you try some of these fresh peas? You'd never know they come out of a can. Oh! Oh, well, uh, yeah. well just... Come right in.
Sorry, Mr. Hornslager. Hello, Johnny. Uh, you sit right down here, Mr. Hornslager. Say, I know you're going to be tickled to death with this show. You ready, bud? Go! We've got a surprise finish. I'd like to have you see it. Surprise finish? Yeah. Well, it better be good. It's Lola! 
broken. So that's a surprise you're holding that great work, Kennedy. We have the goods on that crook at last. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. Great work, Kennedy. Now, Kennedy, don't forget, see me about that raise in the morning. Oh, boss, thanks. <laughs> Honey, did you hear what he said? <laughs> oh, no, you're oh, all right. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, I'm going to buy a new piano. Well, so Logan is an acrobat. I feel so happy I could turn a flip-flop myself. I think I will. Oh, Come on, clear the way, everybody. Clear out. Here I come, boys. <laughs> Si? Too bad, Kennedy, but just think how bad it would be if you hadn't sold us all that accident insurance. Oh, 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 Good night, Mrs. Kennedy. Oh,